Hi, this is Prophetess Afia Sabrina Acapo with Crown of Glory Ministries and just wanted to share a little heart to heart with you on today because it was on my mind and I was actually going over these scriptures as well. And the first thing that came to my mind that I wrote down was healing and deliverance scriptures. So I know that this was just not for myself. And as with any prophetic word, you would definitely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the spirits to affirm and confirm that this prophetic word is for you. So, healing and deliverance. I've been reading and just meditating on those scriptures uh, because this is something that God wants me to do. And then it was just unctioned in my spirit to let you know as well. And for those who are going through oppression and depression to pull up all those scriptures and he's just wanting you to pray and he's just wanting you to meditate on those uh, scriptures. He's wanting you to meditate on all scriptures day and night um, and never let them depart from your mouth. But definitely these scriptures just came to mind today because I wrote them down. I actually have them in my notes and I was actually meditating on them and the Lord wanted me to share them with you. I know that there is someone that is going through it as well. So pull up every scripture on healing and deliverance and oppression and depression. And always, always, always stay in prayer um, and know that God is with you every step of the way. And... I'm going to give you a scripture that I was just focusing on a few moments ago, and it's Ephesians 6, um, verses 10 through 18. Finally, be strong in the Lord and in his mighty power. Put on the full armor of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's schemes. For our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the authorities, against the powers of this dark world, and against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly realms. Therefore, put on the full arm of God, so that when the day of evil comes, you may be able to stand your ground. And after you have done everything to stand, stand firm, then with the belt of truth buckled around your waist with the breastplate of righteousness in place and with your feet fitted with the readiness that comes from the gospel of peace. In addition to all this, take up the shield of faith with which you can extinguish all the flaming arrows of the evil one. Take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the spirit, which is the word of God, and pray in the spirit on all occasions with all kinds of prayers and requests. With this in mind, be alert and always keep on praying for all the Lord's people. So faith is the key. Prayer is the key. Standing strong is the key. The, you, the word is the key because it's going to cause you to be able to uh, have that full armor on at all times. And it's going to cause you to be able to stand firm and it's also going to cause you to be able to stand strong. So just wanted to give you that little heart to heart uh, on today as well as this prophetic word. And also one more thing that the Lord just brought to my spirit is also going to keep your mind stayed on Jesus. It's going to also keep your mind and your thought process at peace. So I pray that this has encouraged as well as edified someone on today because it has done for me as well. It's really opening up some things in my spirit and in my mind um, and causing me to think on thoughts of the pure, thoughts of the holy, thoughts of a good report. And the same for you. I decree and I declare it over your life by the redemptive power of the blood of Jesus Christ and the spirit as well as in the physical realm. So I will talk with you guys later. I love each and every one of you. Thank you so much for your continued support of my channel. I do appreciate it. And if you have not subscribed, we would love to have you a part of the family. And thank you for the ones who have subscribed. 
Once again, I love you guys. I will talk with you guys later. God bless you. Take care. Good night. See you soon. Bye-bye.